everybody welcome back to my channel how are you doing i hope you're doing well so we are officially in spooky season uh hence the spooky season makeup this look will be up on my instagram very very soon so keep tuned stay tuned follow me if you want to see how this look is created but today we are jumping in to a tk maxx slash home sense haul now home sense and tk maxx are pretty much the exact same thing so little disclaimer there if you don't know i think it's like the american's version of tj maxx we have tk maxx so as it is spooky season i went in the other day and i picked up a few homeware bits and i was just going to show you what i bought but then i thought do you know what i actually have a hack for beauty and that is that tk maxx and home sense actually do high-end beauty products for a lot cheaper so i literally went on the website i did do this online because in store you can't always count on it but on the website you can always get high-end products and i got some really good high-end products so i'm going to show you how to do bougie on a budget so i'm going to jump into the homeware stuff first and then we will do the makeup stuff after so yeah let's get into it so the first thing i'm going to talk about is this thing here this is a cactus as you can quite clearly tell let me grab it this is the cactus that i picked up from home sense this isn't a real cactus it's like a plasticky one but it's got like a terracotta look part with some like dirt fake dirt inside and then this cactus and i really really like this i think it's like quite a nice aesthetic and it only cost me 12 pounds which i don't think is too bad at all so this is in my background kind of looks a bit like a rampant rabbit from that way but it's fine and then i also picked up this cactus up here this look that was five pound in the reduced section and i was like thank you very much i'm having that to put on my tray so i also picked up another cactus which cost me five pounds now moving on to something that home sense and tk maxx do so so well is candles now i picked up that little candle there the other week as well but i'm not going to go into that one because it's just a smoked oud candle and i love smoked oud 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 smoked oud don't know but moving on i picked up some candles that i absolutely fell in love with now if you know me you know i love a bonfire scent i love deep musky scents i like a tobacco smell i like um fire i like wood i like that kind of stuff i'm not really a sweet kind of person like all of the pumpkin and cinnamon candles just don't do it for me and make me feel a bit sick so i picked up three candles and the first candle i picked up was a mini one now they had this in a big version but it was 15 pounds and i was like i'm not picking buying like a 15 pound candle and it's just like a black hexagonal pot and it just says cognac and ember on the front and it is honestly the most amazing smell it's like fresh linen meets fire and it's like honestly unreal possibly one of my faves so i picked up that and that was only 2.99 next one we have is this candle it is a black tubbed candle and it is by a brand called lab with just like a copper lid and it says dark amber and oud oud warm cedar clove black myrrh and spiced amber coconut wax blend honestly this is absolutely beautiful this cost me 6.99 and it literally smells like a fire and i'm obsessed with that so this is just what it looks like it's really beautiful packaging i do go for scents but i also go for packaging so when it burns out and i've got nothing left inside it that way i can use the pots again because they're pretty but this is actually a two wicker if you can see we love a two wick so yeah i picked up that it's just a really woody scent and i like that i like it a lot then finally possibly my favorite candle and um actually while i'm here i want to mention the lighting it is going to keep changing because we are in winter and things get dark things get bright right now i look dark so the final candle which is quite possibly my favorite candle is this so this is the mystic oracle leather musk candle and it is by dw home and it is just beautiful like look at the front it's like a matte black packaging with like a little gold label right up my street and then on the top it has a little ghosty and some stars and this smells like cigarettes mixed with a man's aftershave that's the best way to describe it and that is actually possibly the best smelling thing i've ever smelled what does it say it doesn't it just says leather musk it doesn't have like a 
a scent description then in store i also picked up some eyelashes now i am always on the hunt for cheaper eyelashes because I get like you've got your high-end brand lashes and they're like 10, 15 pound a pair, but I'm not gonna pay 10, 15 pound a pair for a pair of eyelashes that when I take off, they sit in a tray, probably collect dust. It's probably not great for your eyes, to be honest with you, I'm not gonna lie. So I'm always on the hunt for nice but cheaper lashes. So like the So Su lashes that they sell in Primark, they are amazing, they're only five pound a pair. But these I found and they are 3D faux mink weightless volume and curl and they are cruelty free, which is like best thing ever and these were only 2 99 now these look like the lashes that i actually use all of the time and as you can see kind of they have a little curl at the bottom so i like that they're not just straight lashes and these are by a brand called color multi-dimensional lashes premium quality so i'm gonna try these out and i'll report back to you okay so moving on to the products that i picked up online it's not a very big box because the products are quite small but i got some good 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 deals okay i also picked up some jewelry as well and tk maxx's jewelry is unreal like i never realized how good it was so i'm gonna just start and just dive straight in so the first thing that i picked up is this now this is the new garnier skin active botanical balm nourishing moisturizer three in one day night mask and it is in the honey flower scent and this was 4 99 now i've seen anastasia kings north talk about this and she has the pink rose one i think it just looks like this on the inside just looks really really nice and you can use it as a face mask as well you can use it as a day cream and a night cream so it is a three in one but i saw her talk about this and one of her friends i think bought it for her and she was saying how expensive it is and i saw it in tesco and i think it was like 14.99 and i picked this up for 4.99 you can see that there is so i thought that was a really really good bargain so i actually picked up a shampoo and conditioner from philip kingsley now i have heard so many people rave about philip kingsley on the internet and how good his stuff is so i was like gonna have to buy some so these actually are rp at 10 pound 50 each and i got these for 5.99 each so i actually saved myself like a tenner which isn't bad at all so i picked up the philip kingsley re-moisturizing shampoo for coarse textured or very wavy frizzy hair as you can see my hair needs some tlc it needs some loving so i picked up this and it's a 75 ml bottle so if this was £10.50 on the website, like on TK Maxx or wherever I saw it, I wouldn't buy it because the price, that £10.50 for 75 mil to me is actually quite expensive when you can get like a litre herbal essences for a pound. Do you know what I mean? But because it was 5 99 I thought, do you know what, I will try it. So this is just what it looks like. It's actually quite like a sleek little thing kind of thing, quite sleek, quite nice just a matte white and so i picked up that one and that is the re-moisturizing one which i definitely need and then i picked up the matching conditioner and this is the moisture extreme one so hopefully we'll get some moisture into my hair get some loving into my hair so this actually says it's for african caribbean hair which do you know what i definitely don't have that i have caucasian hair quite clearly i have used african caribbean conditioners in my hair before and they work like a dream my hair looks so silky and so soft so i am going to give this a go so yeah i got the moisture extreme and the re-moisturizing shampoo because my hair is dry af my hairdresser chloe she's also like one of my best friends but she also she always 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 tells me off because i dye my hair and i don't look after it properly so she's like you need to start looking after your hair so I'm, chloe this is for you so I picked that up and I saved myself a tenner on the two of them, which is great. Moving on to what's on top. We have a Bondi Sands Everyday Face Tan. So I don't tan my face normally. I really don't because I end up looking like a patchy old mess. But because this is for your face and I trust Bondi Sands with my life, to be honest, that is pretty much the only tan I ever really use. And this is the Bondi Sands, the Australian Tan Everyday Face Gradual Tanning Milk. This is what it looks like. So I was thinking, do you know what? That might be all right, actually. Like, it might be quite decent for someone like me who doesn't really tan my face and end up looking ill when I have a tan. Like, when I have a tan, I actually look ill because my body's, like, really nice and tan and then my big white face appears. So, yeah, but it smells like coconuts and I really like it. And this is originally 11 99 and I got it for 7 So 
save myself some dollar there as well. I'm going to go for a Too Faced product. We have Too Faced. Annoyingly, they put the stickers over the front of everything. But this is one of the Too Faced Melted Matte Lipsticks. And I saw this and I was like, perfect. This is a perfect colour for this time of year. So it is actually the Mrs. Roper colour. And it is like an orange. And I was like, this is going to be amazing on my skin for this time of year. Because we're in Halloween and autumn season going into Christmas. And I paid £5 for this. £5. I'm going to have a look what it is. Mrs. Roper is normally £19. And I got it for five on TK Maxx. It's legit, you know, they can't actually sell non-legit stuff. But I will just do a little swatchy, swatchy, swatch for you. It just looks like a really beautiful colour. You see that? It's like an orange, orangey red. Next up, I'm going to pull out this. So this is from Benefit. Now this is the 24 hour brow setter. This is the mini one. So this is the mini one and it looks a little something something like this just your standard little mini from benefit this on look fantastic is 11 pounds and i paid five for this so i saved myself six quid thank you very much so yeah this is all it is 24 hour brow setter love that can't wait to try it out i have all of the other benefit brow things john got me a set of it for christmas so i'm excited to add this to my little collection and moving on to we'll save the best for last i think moving on to this now this isn't like a high-end product i don't believe i've never seen this brand before i could be wrong tell me in the comments if i'm wrong but this i saw and i was like i really want to try this because it looks amazing so it is actually a powdered face mask which you add water to or you add like what i don't know like apple cider vinegar i've seen but this is from the out if this is from the inside out love beauty foods clay face mask glow and it is a hundred percent natural and vegan and it is made from australian pink clay and organic rose this is what it looks like it looks absolutely beautiful and it's like a gorgeous little pinky color this is meant to be really good for your skin so i just picked up that as well and it smells bloody delicious okay we have a couple more things to go so i have a bh cosmetic can't speak a bh cosmetics palette this was 5.99 and it is originally 14 which isn't bad so i've saved myself 11 pounds no nine pounds i failed maths so this is it. it is the royal affair 20 color shadow palette and it has the most beautiful colours. Oh, bye. In it. I absolutely love this. I think this is beautiful. This icy colour is speaking to me. And this bright pink. I'll do a couple of swatches for you. So I'll do some mattes first. So we'll go for Lady. We'll go for Regal. And we'll go for Enchanted. So they are pretty damn good, I won't lie. Wow. Oh, I really want to do a green look with this because that enchanted colour is unreal. And then what else do we have? I'll do three shimmers as well. So I think I'm going to go for um, Princess, which is a pink, high tea and crown. They look lush. For this time of year, that is going to look banging. Yeah, they're, they're some else, aren't they? And then moving on to the last piece of beauty, the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. Sorry about that. So this is originally £39. I'm going to say now I got mine for £12.99. £12.99. £12.99. Now, the people I have seen, I've seen people on Twitter going TK Maxx is like, just like who shops in tk maxx why would you shop in tk maxx this is why i shop in tk maxx because you get good bloody deals and i save good money love all right sorry just had to get that rant out this is the palette and this is actually there you are this is actually my very first Too faced palette i've never had a Too faced palette i've, I've had the Too faced highlighting palette but i've never had an eyeshadow palette from Too faced i don't think 
anyway so we have some really beautiful colors in here um you've probably all seen this because this is a quite an old collection that is one thing i am going to say is it is an older collection kind of thing you don't get the brand new stuff on there like the new releases okay so i'm gonna swatch some of the shimmer shades so i'm gonna go for totally fetch cotton candy and molasses chip so these are quite subtle do you know what i mean they're not as bam in your oh okay i lied they are quite bam in your face so there we go we have the three shimmer shades which look cool af they smell divine it smells of chocolate it's like crack yeah so this is the Too faced chocolate bar palette i have a Too faced palette i'm buzzing and then moving on to jewelry i picked up three pieces of jewelry so the first ones i'm going to show you these actually are rp at 22 pound but i got them for seven and i just think they are beautiful they are from big metal london and they are ni nickel free i can never say that nickel they are nickel free and um, which is good because that nickel can kind of make your ears go a bit green but they are these beauties i absolutely love them i think they're they're very weighty like there's a lot of weight to them they're quite chunky they look kind of like ribboned and I really, really like them. I think they're beautiful. Yeah, I'm really getting into gold jewellery. I'm really enjoying gold jewellery. So I picked up those for £7, which is a bag. B-A-R-G. And then I picked up these. Now, these were £3.99. Were they £4.99? No, they were £4.99. And they actually RRP at £18.45. So... I've saved some monies. So these are from Holt Eust Copenhagen. Holt Eust Copenhagen. They are these really pretty gold hoops with little bubbles on them. I think they look really pretty and really cute. I picked up those. I think they're going to look really, really nice. And for £4, when they were originally 18 I've saved myself some money. And then the final thing, which are possibly my favourite things. These are from... Penny Levi London and it doesn't say the RRP on here so I'm not entirely sure but I paid £9 for these and I love them I think they are beautiful so this is what they look like they are from Penny Levi London and they are just really pretty little lightning bolts and they have little like cubic sacronas I'm not going to say diamonds because they're not they're not um and they are actually sterling silver which I really like, even though they look gold. And so yeah, that is absolutely everything I picked up from TK Maxx. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you buy anything, I will leave as many links as I can down below because I know that TK Maxx bring stock in and take stock out quite quickly. So I really do hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, don't forget to, what was that? If you did, don't forget to smash the thumbs up and subscribe down below and I will see you very soon for another video. Bye guys.